Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to set up and access a VPN on Windows Server 2008. So let's begin. Click on Server Manager. And here, select Roles. Add Roles. Here, the whistle will prompt you with uh, Before You Begin, kind of. But I'm just going to click on Next. You can read it if you want select network policy and access services and click on next next to this window here check mark routing and remote access services next and install really simple installation succeeded perfect now go ahead and click on close I'll close this too start administrative tools routing and remote access now by default is disabled the down arrow as you can see means it's disabled so right click and select configure and enable routing and remote access for this tutorial I'll be using default configuration click next to the wizard select custom configuration next VPN access next finish the wizard perfect start services and now once it's done you can click on finish and if you wait a while it'll remove the window by itself now our uh, routing a remote access is up and running now I'll create the user and set that user up to connect via VPN so click on start administrative tools active directory users and computers in your case you probably have the user already set you just need to enable him to connect so I'll just create a new user here so bear with me new user and I'll name this user myself Miguel Guzman perfect next uh, I'm not gonna change the password I'll set up the password now never expires next finish okay so we have the user here who's going to connect so right click properties dial in tab and select under network access permissions allow access apply ok perfect now I will connect from a Windows 7 machine so click on start control panel network and sharing center now here select set up a new connection or network connect to our workplace set up a dial-up or VPN next use my internet connection VPN now here I'll be using my server LAN IP address if you're connecting via WAN make sure to use your WAN IP address and on the firewall or router port forward port number 1723 go ahead and click on next once you're done and now enter your username at domain name and the password belonging to that user remember this password is optional and click on connect keep in mind if you're connecting via WAN you need to use your WAN IP address and port forward port number 1723 and or port 47 GRE thank you for watching this video my name is Miguel if you have any questions feel free to post them in the comment section below thank you